Welcome to Football Navigator. Before we can get into this video, please subscribe to the channel, click your notification bells and give us a thumbs up. Today we are interestingly looking at Ifrahim Masilele Sono's biography, all things about his age, career, wife, net worth, all things possible you may want to know. Ifrahim Masilele Sono, known professionally as Jomo Sono, is a South African football coach, club owner and former professional football player. He also goes by a few nicknames that weren't given to him because of his skill and popularity. Black Prince of South African Soccer, Braje and Jomana. Ifrahim Maslele Sonu, a.k.a. Joma Sonu, was born in Johannesburg, South Africa on the 17th of July, 1955. He celebrated his 67th birthday in July, 22. The exact estimate of Joma Sonu's net worth is unknown to the public. However, his success in the business world and on the sports scene has not gone unnoticed. Sonu is believed to be worth millions of rands as a result of his businesses and previous career. He owns a food chain business and hotels. He also owns a football club with which is quite popular. Joma Sono met the love of his life, Gail Sono, many years ago. The couple got married in 1979 and had four children together. According to reports, their wedding happened on the same day as South African Orlando Pirates were playing against Highlands Park. With the permission of his father-in-law, the football star had to leave his wedding to attend the game. Joma Sono's marriage to Gail was blessed with the beautiful and hard-working children. His daughter, Nigo Sono, is the former marketing manager of the Cosmos Club. So Sono's son Bamuza took after his father playing skills. He plays for Jomo Cosmos FC and also works as the acting team manager in South Africa. Jomo Sono's business was not only great at playing football but he also had brains for the bigger things in business. After his football career which spanned three decades, Sono worked as the technical director and coach for South African team Bafana Bafana. He also began doing business in Soweto. There he became the first owner of the KFC franchise according to reports. He also owns hotels in South Africa apart from food chains. Jomason has not shared any photos of the car he drives. He keeps such information away from the public. While Jomason has not shared photos of his home, he is reported to live in a luxurious house. He also reportedly owns several other properties in South Africa. Sono's father was Eric Bamuza Skaz Sono. He was a South African soccer player who ignored the apartheid laws, which prohibited people of different races from competing with one another. He also captained the Orlando Pirates football club at the age of 27. Eric Sono died in a car crash. His son, Jomo Sono, was eight when he died. Jomo Sono sold apples and peanuts at a stadium to care for his grandparents and himself. One day during a match, one of the Orlando Pirates regular players was absent and Sono was requested to stand in for him. He scored two goals for the team and was invited to play with them permanently. He soon gained fame for his skills including dribbling and accurate passing skills. It earned him the nickname Jomo. By an Orlando Pirates fan, they saw in him the same leadership qualities as those of Jomo Kenyatta. He also played for the New York Cosmo in the U.S. as well as other popular clubs. He returned to South Africa and bought the Highlands Park Club and remained it, renamed it Jomo Cosmos in honor of his old dad. The club has achieved several success under his leadership.